Good news has come to the citizens of Lothal. The Outer Rim planet has been granted the coveted opportunity to participate in the new Imperial Registration Program. Alton Castle. On the Holonet news around 14 years into Sidious' rule as Emperor, the Empire had begun its expansion into the Outer Rim. Worlds like Jalukan saw occupation and development, leading to rampant pollution and industrialization to support the Imperial War Machine. One such world that was developed was Lothal, which joined the Imperial Registration Program seeking protection and economic opportunities whereby local citizens would find work in the local CNR fleet systems facilities. Ostensibly this was to grow the local economy, but was in fact secretly part of a much larger five-year plan involving numerous Outer Rim worlds that was overseen by the Imperial Outer Rim High Command, a subdivision of Imperial High Command which was in charge of the Outer Rim territories. But the Empire did not fully control the Outer Rim and often utilized its worlds instead as testing grounds for new biological weapons and as a source of cheap labor. Lothal's industrial importance soon came to the fore for the Empire as the Emperor planned to further expand Imperial Dominion over the Outer Rim territories and beyond. In order to maximize the worth of newly occupied systems, worlds such as Lothal soon bore witness to Imperial authorities relocating farmers away from their farmlands to mine for Imperial purposes, leading to the development of resettlement camps such as Tangletown and Lothal Resettlement Camp 43, known by the residents as Tarkentown, after the governor of the Outer Rim. The Empire also limited the holo net across the Outer Rim, leading many dissatisfied systems to view the embargo as a part of the conquest of the Outer Systems.